Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Hidden Flame, and let's hope this works correctly. Um, so, things are different. Things are a lot different. I'm not, I'm not outside of 101. I'm not outside Space Station. I'm not outside the Outcast. So, I was thinking of redoing those episodes. Uh, I had an issue with a... Um, with a deleted hard drive. Yes. Hard drive got deleted. Lost a lot of things. Now, look at this. This is currently where I'm at. 10 hours, 31 minutes, 52 seconds. 54 minutes, 34 seconds. That is nearly 10 hours of redo. So, here's the brief thing. Went to Minefield. Did the Minefield for uh, Moria. Went to the spaceship. Got a bunch of... Um, got the guns, got the ammo, got everything. I have a mod. Mod lets me make alien blaster ammo. Okay. I don't know exactly what I need to make alien blaster ammo, but I have it. Got the. I mean, went to the. Uh, the Outcast. Got the stealth suit. Now I'm here. There's 10 hours of work. I don't even see the alien blaster ammo. Anyway, I'm not going to be using it for a while. I'm going to take that with me to New Vegas. Now, I'm going to be running the assault rifle, my laser rifle, trench knife, and have some mines. I'm running the stealth suit, so I should be okay. So, current mission, find Dad. What's happening? Unlike the first episode, the second episode is going to be two hours. We're going to get that done. We're going to try to do it as quick and as painless as possible. Will I do the pit? Will I do the um, point lookout? I'll leave that up to you. If you want to see it, let me know. Put it down in the comments. Junk. Every day it's the same damn thing. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave station comes in fine. It's Galaxy News. Their signal's been shit lately. Son of a bitch. Work. Come on, work. Hi there. I'm Nova. New to Megaton, huh? Do yourself a favor. Keep walking. Some of us stay for a few days, and then it's five years later. Looking for my father. Middle-aged guy. Maybe see him? Yeah, I remember that man. I saw him talking to Moriarty. Hard to forget handsome men like that. <laughs> no, the tough chick routine. Please tell me more. Oh, you like it rough, huh? Well, that got extra. Beat it, kid. Go look for daddy somewhere else. You just I leave that fucking thing alone, Gob. Go fuck. Boy, God damn, lady. I like the on-place. Oh, right You're not going to get anything. Colin Moriarty, at your service. Welcome to Moriarty. My saloon, my home, my slice of heaven in this backwoods little burg. You've got the caps. I've got your pleasure. Please sit down and make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. I'm looking for my father, Middle East guy. Maybe you've seen him? God, it's you. The little baby girl, all grown up. Persistent little flower, ain't you? Then and now, it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here already. <laughs> here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? You, <laughs> My father and I have been... We're born in Vault 101. Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole. That he was born there as well. <coughs> oh, 
the lies we tell to those we love. <coughs> Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well. You stayed in my saloon, after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood a steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tete suckle. Sorry about your mom, truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. <laughs> My dad told me how we were born in Vault 101. Ah, I see. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some other fella, escaped. Oh, five years back. All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault. We die in the vault and all that other assorted lunacy. Kid, you've got better programming than our own deputy weld. You best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? Let's cut to the chase. How much for you to tell me where he is? You catch on quick, kid. That's the way of it out here, for sure. You want something, you take it. Or you pay in cold, hard caps. Say, a hundred. Seems a fair price to facilitate a family reunion, don't you think? All right, here you go. Now, where's my father? Excellent. Your dad raised a smart kid. Really no substitute for the love of a father, now is there? Speaking of dear old dad, he went south east... Oops. Got something on your mind? He went southeast to the galaxy of... Yeah, honey. What do you need? Something from me, the galaxy of news. The galaxy news radio. Now, having dropped the alien ammo, I mean rifles and blasters and stuff to the merchants, there's a good chance... Uh, other people, like raiders and bandits and whoever else out there, buys them. <clears throat> so, got to keep an eye on who gives what. Okay, so, dup, 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 dup. here we go. Welcome We're going this way. Now, I don't really remember too much about what, where everything is in this game. So, it's going to be interesting to see how good we run. And yes, the reason I'm carrying a, a weapon... I'll take that. Uh, is just due to the fact... Microfusion cells are pretty rare to come by right now. Oh, I want to hit left trigger and run. But no, that's not the game I'm playing. See? Stealth. Someone told me if you uh, crouch while stealth in this game, you get uh, you have to use AP to stay stealth. But I guess not. I wonder if they it's been removed. Yep. I heard either a shotgun or a Gauss rifle. Raiders. Enclave by. Dog. Oh. Hello. I'll take all that. Whatever it is I got, I'll take it. Ooh. 
Well, that's a lot of items. <clears throat> anyway, let's keep going. That's one of the one things I do not like regarding this game is the fact you can't run. And honestly, Fallout 3 is really quick. You can beat this game in minutes. What is it? The record's about 14 minutes? Nope. I know what I'm doing. I think. I will slaughter you all! Uh, where is it? <clears throat> Average lock, can't get in it, metro key, cool. Nope, not getting that way, okay. Bringing out the Chinese dragon, the sultry fall. Battle caps. Big boy. Goodbye, big boy. Okay, they're not attacking me. Where am I at? Take the bait, take the teddy bear. That's all. 
seems like that's a what I'm talking about. Looks that way. Seems like a waste of ammo. That's how we do it in the Lion's Pride, you fucking freak. Look, I don't know who you are, but you don't belong here. The super mutants have overrun our brothers at the Galaxy News radio building, and we're headed there to back them up. You can tag along if you want, but keep your head down and try not to do anything stupid. Thanks for the assist. Didn't know this place was dangerous. You've been living under a rock? This is DC. The entire city is crawling with super mutants. Now, if you'll excuse me. Means you Galaxy News Radio? There aren't a lot of safe places in the ruins right now, but the Galaxy News Radio building is sort of our port in the storm. Unfortunately, the building's been hit pretty hard lately. We're their backup. So if there are no more questions, we really need to move out. New recruits? That's a negative. We've got too many local conscripts as it is. Most are undertrained and too damn trigger happy for their own good. Our very own initiate Redden is a sterling example. Watch it. Okay, I'll be I'll follow you. Redden on me. You're doing fine. Just follow my lead. No dead heroes today. What's the situation? All clear, Sentinel. Five mutants released from their torment. The rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Jenny? Negative. A new recruit? Just a stray we picked up. The one that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome. All right. It's the usual drill. Redden, you just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. Yes, ma'am. My gun's a lot more powerful than yours. I have a scope of mine. What do you have you on yours? Ooh. Well, the ammo, that's for sure. Oh. Battle cap. I want those targets down now. this building. Come with me if you like. We'll have the best view. Masters already, huh? So, how did I do, Vargas? Pass my little trial run? Come on, Lion's Pride needs me and you know it. That Citadel guard duty is such bullshit. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. We're clear out here. Now, Stand down. Off. You're wasting ammo. Come on, we just kicked their asses. We need to sweep the area. Yeah, I'm gonna hide over here.
Haha, <laughs> you can't get me. Oh, hello. Yeah, I might as well grab the key. I guess it's my turn to thank you. Anyway, the area's secure, so you're free to talk to Three Dog if you need to. So, you're not looking for grits? I'm sure. You can handle yourself, I'll give you that. But let's not get carried away. You guys don't screw around. I'll take that as a compliment. If we don't try to keep the mutants from killing everyone and everything in the capital wasteland, who will? The Brotherhood does its best, but sometimes it takes a little something special. That's where the lion's pride comes in. Sorry about Redden. She died well. In the end, that's all that really matters. Watch yourself out there. Really not a fan of the Brotherhood, to be completely fair. Looks like it's all clear, unlocking outer doors. Welcome to the GNR Garrison. look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am Three Dog, jockey of discs and teller of truths, lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes, Galaxy News Radio. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old dad, huh? Met him already. That's the flashy introduction. Hey, when you're in the good fight, you gotta give it all you got and never, ever hold back. Always dazzle them, I always say. Always dazzle them and spread the word. Good fight? What's that about? Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the capital wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day, fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie, too, and aim to take it by force. So you fight the good fight with your voice on Galaxy News Radio. Well, holy shit. Aren't you a chip off the old block? You are as smart as your dad. Since you know all about this cause, no need to explain the effect. Let's get you on your way. Looking for my dad. Have you seen him? Oh, come on. You're a spitting image of the guy. He's been here before, and now you're here. Doesn't take a genius to figure it out. You want to find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. But, but if you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. If you know anything, you want to find your dad. And it just so happened, he was here at Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more. I'm ready for anything. Good. 
because this isn't going to be easy. Galaxy News Radio is my baby. I love it. I feed it. I keep it changed. But there's one problem. No one outside of D.C. can hear her cry. You see, some brainless super mutant thought it would be funny to shoot at the shiny round thing on the Washington Monument. I don't like the sound of this. No, oh, it gets worse. So, after it gets blown up, I look into how to replace the sucker. Guess what? The factory that made the relay dishes is long gone, leveled. As in, we'll never find that part again. Uh, okay. It is risky. I would never lie to you. But there's something behind those eyes of yours that screams, I'm the one that can get shit done. Your dad had that same look in his eyes, too. That's why three dogs helping you. How can I help? One of the Brotherhood guys that passed through here mentioned seeing a dish in one of DC's old museums. It's the dish off the old Virgo 2 lunar lander in the Museum of Technology. I want you to get it and bring it to the Washington Monument to replace the bad one. That's it. Mm, get yourself a deal. <laughs> I sure know how to pick them. You're going to be the best thing that ever happened to Galaxy News in a long time. If you need any more info, I'll be here waiting for you. Where's my back exit? Is it over here? No. Is it over here? Yoink. No, there's a back door. I just gotta find it. Ah, there we are. <sighs> okay. Crap. That doesn't work? Okay. That's what I was trying to do. DuPont Station.
the hell? Yay. What do we got? Oh, let's finish off this. <sighs> let's work on repair. Wait, what? Really? It's not going to let me jump? You've got to be kidding me. Whatever. Anything over here? Was I not even supposed to come over this way? It looks like I'm just going back to Dupont Station. Yeah, I wasn't even supposed to come this way. I am doing the right mission, right? Yeah. Didn't even need to come that way. Hi, you. So that was a waste of ammo. Wow, I'm not even really recording for 30 minutes. Freaking speeding through this. Either I'm going really quick or the time's going slow. Either way, I'm rocking this. Take that. Waters. Oh, for hell. For heaven's sake.
Do you have any ammo I could use? Well, at this rate, I think I might only do one hour videos. Bloody hell. I'm flying through this. Come on. Come on. doing out there. that, take that. Oh, going this way. Okay. Screw this.
Yeah, that was probably a bad idea. I missed my shot, too. Go stealth. Hello, someone there. Stop. I'm going to eat your arm when you're dead. <laughs> Must die. Really, dude? Bloody hell. kitchen system makes cooking a breeze. Concerns about security? Our eye on you cameras and should the unlikely event arise that the planet is laid to waste, you'll feel we hope you've enjoyed our tour today. If you have any further questions, please take a look. tech guides.
that hurt the eyes. What the hell? I ran out of ammo, so I'm... Oh, are you kidding me? hunger for knowledge regarding the universe. To understand why man is so interested in this unknown expanse of space around our little world, we must take a journey. Please, sit back, relax, and free yourself from the bonds of our planet as we take off for the stars. Stars. Planet as we stars. Oh, for, for fuck's sake! As long as history has been recorded, man has had an insatiable hunger for knowledge regarding the universe. To understand why man is so interested in this unknown expanse of space around our little world, we must take a journey. Are they gonna chase me? I think they're gonna chase me.
Where is it? Again, karma. Cannot pass travel from this location. Thought I could. <sighs> Minus impacts. The hero of the wasteland returns. Just do what it had to be done. And well done indeed. Now GNR can be heard clear across the capital wasteland again. That'll give Eden and those muties something to think about. But before I get back to my calling, I bet you want to hear about your dad. Please. Oh yeah, where's my dad gone? When your dad passed through here, he and I talked for a good long time. He's a real stand-up kind of guy. He mentioned some scientific mumbo-jumbo, which didn't make sense to me. And mentioned something called Project Purity. He also said something about going to visit a Dr. Lee in Rivet City. Then he left in a hurry. Where's that? You never heard of Rivet City? Wow. <coughs> Just... Wow. Well, a whole bunch of people got together and turned a beached aircraft carrier into a town. Pretty cool, huh? Just follow the river south from here. There's no way you can miss it. Everything's now the power's back on. I can't even tell you the love I'm getting from the wasteland. Ever since G and I started singing again, the guys downstairs told me that more people than ever are tuning in. It's all I ever wanted. I have to go now. Anytime you need a place to crash, duck in here. Be glad to provide. Which I do need to nap. Okay, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Um, I'm going to do this quick. So, I will see you guys next week for more Tales of Two Wastelands. For now, have a good night.